Wessex Blades. Hello everybody, thanks for joining me again. Long time no see. Close up in a minute. <sighs> Doing some a little bit of leather treatment as we chat over the last couple of weeks has been going on. Had a lovely time doing this sheath and a new blade. What that meant is I had to do a completely new cardboard template. There he is. Worked it out and then of course you got the bottom and the top. Don't make it left handed, eh Williams? So it's already had its uh, feed. I just add in a, a fourth coat of Carnuba cream, which is the Carnuba nut based top coat. All in thick veg tan leather, which is undyed to start with. And then I have to cut it all to fit. Plan it out, glue it, put all the holes in by hand with forky spike things, and then you got the challenge of getting through not only the lever, the well, the well, the lever, but the layer of hard glue in the middle, which is more of a more like fibre liner, it's that hard. So all the holes matching up on both sides. It had a, a sort of greenish set of liners. So if you look very carefully on the close-ups, you'll see that it's got a dark green uh, set of stitching on it. Oh, nice. And I even mambled the back just to lift it above the bog standard. Fold over sheaf with one well. This is as Wessex as you can get, I think. <laughs> it's beastie. Right. That's got a nice layer of carnauba on it. Let that just dry off, and now we can buff it off. section of the towel has not got the, uh, the actual wax in it, you can buff it. Smell. Okay, so, the sheaf, small and twee. <laughs> Where you do your template, so you're actually putting the knife blade down on a, on a cereal box or some stiff card or some description, and get the line of the handle to match the line of the strap as it goes to the hang on your belt. And the hang should be about right because it's slightly off that set, but you still got what was the knee there, which I've ground off a bit. So oh, beautiful. A few close-ups later. Outside, get some good light in it. Far better light than in here. But yeah, drop us your comments what you think of it. Yeah. There are many uh, make shoes like that, is there? Well, I know it's hard to get hold of a lot of makers' work because they're so busy. But um, if I only make one every two weeks, they're pretty rare. Blessings pretty rare. So this is Gab. I shall give you an email 
you may be jumping up and down and say, oh, it's my cookery. Right, so yeah, it's done. And just because I could, and I was a piece of iron wood, you have a sort of neck pendant ferro rod as well. Thanks for your patience, Gav. Much appreciated. We'll catch up this week or weekend and get it off to you as soon as I can. Next thing is a Lecou for Ralph, the legend it is. Um, and then I'm cracking on with Mark's prepper knife. But that's in the garage with some handle material and other things. But I just pressed on with this. That's how I can only do one thing at a time, unfortunately. Uh, so that's the way of Wessex. Look at the way of Wessex. They got some Mandalorian thing come on, and apparently that's the way. This is the way. Slow and steady. This is the way. It's got Wessex, please drop a comment, do a like, and if you're new to the channel, yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. You're running a mill night maker. 